Hello and welcome to Ready Sets Gaming. I am Ready Set and I hope you all are having a fantastic evening this evening. For those of you that are new to the channel, welcome. Again, I am Ready Set and on my channel I predominantly stream indie games with a dash of retro and a hint of triple A. So for tonight's stream, we are going to get into our indie game showcase for tonight um which consists of four different games um the first game is torn away which was commissioned by alex then we are going to play some berserk boy which was provided to me um from the developer for free then we're going to play Rabbit Hole, which is a free-to-play game. And then for the remainder of stream, we'll do Chill Town, which is an early access. And which was provided to me, again, by the developers. So I hope you all are having a fantastic evening. Um, there is going to be times during the stream that I will mute my mic. Um, I just got a pint of ice cream and I have nowhere to store it. So I kind of have to eat it um yeah i have terrible timing um but um so that's what's all on the card for this evening of course as always if you are here in chat and any of the games for tonight's stream interest you you can use exclamation point g-o-t-c if you are here in chat and of course if you are in if you are watching this sorry on youtube then the information for the game will be in the description box below now because i do stream using a hotspot due to my situation i do record each of the games so if there is a game that you are interested in but cannot stick around to see or watch fear not I do upload the actual highlights of each game to YouTube as well. So I do the full stream for those that want to watch the entire stream. And then I also do highlights for people who are looking for just specific games. Um, and then those are usually uploaded to YouTube, usually after my stream. If not by tomorrow, they'll be on YouTube for your viewing pleasure. With that being said, we're going to get to our first game of the evening. And that is Torn Away. So let us go ahead. And start up Torn Away. Hopefully this will just capture It should have just captured because it's a Unity game. Okay. Maybe not. I'm going to see if I can maybe... Grab it this way. Okay, so it looks like it may have captured. Yeah, okay. All right, and so our first game of the evening is Torn Away. And this one is available through Steam on PC for $14.99 USD. Again, this game was commissioned by Alex. So again, thank you, Alex, for your commission of Torn Away. Um. So it looks like it has multiple languages. Obviously, we're going to do English. Then it has voiceover. So it says original, which is recommended. English or original. We're going to do English for the voiceover. Because that will stop it so that I don't have to. Like, if it's a lot of reading, I won't have to really read it. Um, which will also allow for me to be able to mute here and there. Um, so, yeah. Let's go ahead and jump into this. And we're going to confirm. Adjust the brightness. Adjust the brightness so the mug disappears and the key is barely visible. Okay. 
I'm good like that. Confirm. Oh, is this an episodic game? Oh, okay. So as you go through, okay, cool. Um, settings. Graphics is normal. Controls. Okay. Back. Music, sound, speech. Okay. Um, I'm going to adjust the sound over here a little bit too. Just in case it's a little low. Okay. So go back. New game. And let's get into this. This game uses save. Do not turn off the device when you see this symbol. Okay. Dedicated to all the children and civilians affected by war. Uh oh. Support each other. Okay, this looks nice. I like the graphics. As yet, don't just sit around. Food is getting cold. Attention. This is Moscow today. At four o'clock in the morning, German armed forces attacked the borders of the Soviet Union. Without a declaration of war, the great patriotic war has begun. Did you have a bad dream? Oh my gosh, she's talking to herself. All she hears is these toys talking to her. Uh huh. Oh no. Don't wow. worry so much, I'm fine. Okay. Sure you are. Then who was crying all last night? You know what, madam? We don't like you. <laughs> like, that's rude, madam. Enough, madam. Today is a new day. Yeah. Where are Katie's in? A special one at that. Was it her birthday? Do you think she remembers? Mom's birthday? Of oh. course I do. I've never doubted it. Have you decided what you're going to get her? Not yet. How so? At least I have a list of things Mom loves. I've been working on it all last night. Oh, that's great. Will you tell us what you came up with? I don't remember. Then... You should check the list. Okay, let me adjust because it looks like it's peeking in the yellow. So I'm going to turn it down just a little bit. Yes, you should. Is that the list you tore up and threw all over the room last night? None of your business. Right, madam? Uh-uh. <laughs> Put madam away. Goodness me. We'll find it all. Glue it back together and sort it all out. I like Arcady. Okay. I can't color the picture properly with these colors. I need more pencils. Okay. We'll take that. I don't know, I have a very... Yeah. 
Here's the first piece of the list. Now we need to find the rest. Okay. Oh, control the crouch. Okay. I wish we could inflate it so that it would bounce like new. Okay. Nobody plays with her in the courtyard anyway. <gasps> Madam! Uh -huh. <sighs> oh, these candies were so yummy. The wrappers still smell of chocolate. Remember how many pimples you got from that? <sighs> madam, what is going on? <laughs> like, I mean, Madam is just like very pessimistic. That's no reason to deny yourself. Exactly. I'm like, ma'am. She like, remember all the pimples you got? Like, madam. Okay, and then space to jump. This There's another pencil. Later. Mom used to read to me in the evenings. Okay. You're a grown-up now and manage quite well by yourself, don't you? Uh-huh. You can go to the creek to sail them again when Dad comes back. I can't wait. Oh. Oh, I think it's supposed to kind of be like showing you how to do everything. Whoosh! Off we go! Quite the little fighter plane. I don't approve of such games. Madam. We should find your list first, otherwise we won't have time to make the present before your mum comes. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Want to go for a ride? I'm too old for such games. If you say so, dearie. But, I mean, you, like, legitimately sitting up here talking to these... Okay. That should have been an achievement, jumping on the bed. That should have been an achievement, I'm just saying. Want to go for a I'm too Okay, we already did that. So. Okay. Talk to you until you apologize for stinking. Oh, okay. That's why Madam's being so mean. Well, then don't. Oh! <laughs> well, that happened. <laughs> I mean, you know, <laughs> right on, I guess. Okay. She's like, I ain't talking to you till you apologize for scaring me. Well, then don't. <laughs> like, man. Look how it reaches for the sun. Aw. Be even better if you didn't forget to water it. it see, madam, that's why she scared you. Because you're mean. But there's the last piece. Yes, that was the last one. 
let's sit down at the desk and figure things out. Okay. I can't color the picture properly. Oh. Wow. I didn't know you kept a diary. Yes, but don't look. I don't want anyone to read my diary. That makes sense. Oh, I'm just heartbroken. <laughs> Mad hub. Here it is. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay. Mom loves dad listening to music, my drawings, and me. Wait, why did she cross off me? <laughs> That's a good observation. You always upset her. Madam. Madam is why <laughs> this little girl's going to end up in therapy. Like, Don't be silly. Katerina Simeonovna is... She loves everyone. Even you, madam. Indeed. Yes, you are talented at that. You can draw Dad coming back. Good idea. How about putting some music on before she comes? That would create some festive mood. I should mend Dad's mitten. Okay. So to view the notes. Dear Diary, Mom gave you to me quite a long time ago when I started first grade. I felt like there was nothing to write about before, though. Then the war started. Dad went to the front lines, and I began to think about things more often. I want to get into the good habit of writing everything down. Maybe it will all... Maybe it will at least make mom happy. July 1st, 1942. Okay. Mom is in a really bad mood today. I wanted to introduce her to my friends, Madam and Arcacia. But she told me not to make things up and that instead I should read the books I was assigned at school for the summer. Or rather, the books she assigned. It's hard being the teacher's daughter. Who cares about books when there's so much going on? I've been drawing a lot lately. I don't know if I'm good at it, but as Dad says, what matters is if you like it. Oh, Daddy, we miss you so much. July 30th, 1942. I haven't written for a long time. I haven't been in the mood. The summer is turning out to be a bit pointless. None of the neighborhood kids want to talk to me, so most of the time I just go for walks alone, and sometimes I play on the swings. But the weather is nice. I spend most of the time with my toys. August 15, 1942. This is Arcady, my hobby horse. Dad made it for me in the village when I was really little. Arkesha always knows how to comfort me. Okay. This is Madam. My doll. Even though she is a bit of a meanie, I still love her. <laughs> okay. These candies were so yummy. Chocolates. I can still remember it. Okay. Well, it's time to get to work. Okay. Or we might not finish in time. I'm assuming now we can leave out because she needs her color pencils. The heck? I'm not even going to ask how they got outside of the room, you know. Magic. 
Well, we agreed that we need to fix Dad's mitten, put yes. on music, and finish the drawing. Okay. Is this Dad's mitten? Katerina Simeonovna has never gotten around to mending this handsome guy. As soon as she picks him up, she starts crying. I mean, is her dad dead? She must be thinking about dad freezing without this mitten. I get sad thinking about that too. Well, you need some thread, a needle, and a little bit of patience. I remember seeing a box with all the tools around here somewhere. Okay. Nope, so no way to speed this up. Take everything that you might need to mend our woolen friend. Okay. We need needle, thread, and a thimble. Okay, I guess these buttons. Think. Okay, so let's walk back over here and men lay well, mentor. Now that all the tools are in place, there's not much left to do. The main thing is not to rush. Oh, man. One step at a time. Okay. Remember how mom taught you? Don't you supposed to like lick the end of the thread or something? We're halfway through. Okay. Careful. Don't prick yourself. Okay. There, it can be worn again. How about we leave just one? He'll be just like General Kutuzov. <laughs> oh, wow. Now he's definitely ready. <laughs> what a handsome fellow. Yay. Greetings. All the best to you, old chap. Now you fit me really well. Mm. No wonder. You sure sewed me up tight. Now I'll never let go. Oh, okay. That's good because my hands are always cold. And sorry to hear about that. I'll do notes. Who would have thought Daddy's mitten turned out to be such a wonderful comrade? I have a feeling we're, we'll be together for a long time. Oh, I hope Madam and Arkesha don't get jealous. What's with the crows? Are they afraid of me? Mirror, mirror on the wall. You, of course. Now, let's get back to our work. <laughs> like. Hello to my dearest daughter, Asha, and my wife, Yatinka. I was very glad to get your last letter. I've reread re it probably 200 times already. Asha it was especially nice to receive your drawings. 
They're so wonderful. You must take after your mother to be so gifted. Please send me more. I miss you so much, my darlings. I can't describe it. But don't be discouraged, though. I'll be back soon, and you won't even remember that I left. What else is there to say? There isn't much news here. I'm feeling fine and getting by. Please don't be upset with me. I've been writing to you less often because there is simply no paper here. That's how it worked, how it is. Say hello to everyone for me. Goodbye for now. Lots of love. Lots and lots of hugs and kisses. Your father, your father, pet ya. I'm pretty sure I probably pronounced that wrong. Oh, that was a long time ago. I hope mom isn't mad at dad because a letter did not arrive on her birthday. Mm. Don't be silly. Your mother understands. Where would he get paper at the front lines? Dad has his hands full there. You can be sure of that. A month since the last letter is nothing. There comes pessimistic madam for the win. I'm actually trying to rest here. Don't bother. Is it really locked? If there's a lock, there must be a key somewhere. Yeah. What's with all the secrecy? It's always been like that. Okay, so we have to find a key. Oh, maybe. Something on the ground, maybe? Let's put it on. It's been ages since I heard any music. No, okay. I agree. Do you remember what Mom liked to listen to? If I see the cover, I'll recognize it right away. Where does she keep them? <laughs> Whistles. A merry little tune, I'm assuming. Oh, here's another one of the pencils. Left it here for future generations, huh? Not everyone can make such a statement. I promise to never lose you again. I don't think he's mad. I was wondering where this was. I wonder how it ended up here. It do, it does seem really really good. I have no idea. The laws of little Octoburst states, little Octoburst help young pioneers, small members, communists, workers, and peasants. Little Octoburst strive to become young pioneers. Okay. These candy, okay, so that came before the candy thing, and then the, okay. Okay. We already checked that. 
Oh, maybe it's something on the couch, maybe. Our mitten is mended and healthy. Right. I did all of that, though. Let's put it on. I agree. Do you remember? If I see the cup. Where does. She probably keeps them in the thing that's locked. But we don't have a key. Is it really locked? If there's a lock, there must be a key. So What's with all the secrecy? It's always been like that. Okay. Hmm. Maybe there's something else I missed over here. Petya. What a good Petya. His name is Petya. Dad, when are you gonna come back? No. Oh. If Dad promised, then Dad will be back. Don't be sad. Wow. There's that key. Let's find out what it unlocks. We know what it unlocks. Put it back. It unlocks this. Which probably has the album. I have a feeling her dad is like didn't make it or something. Look at that. It fits. Let's grab that. Okay, let's see. Oops. I hope that wasn't anything important. No, not this one. Aha, here it is. Well, you just have to put it on now. Take it. Right? Okay, but I definitely want to pick that up. Oh. They're so... They're so what? Beautiful? Happy. Aww. Can you figure it out? Uh, yeah. I'll try. Do you turn this first? No, you have to put the needle down, I thought. <laughs> Mom and Dad are so young, so happy and carefree. And then that's the... Okay. That's a beautiful melody. Just the thing to put us in the mood to celebrate. Alrighty. Ah, just like the good old times. Okay, so now... Looks like it's gonna rain. Just one more thing left to do. You're on a roll. Make the picture, which should be back in her room. Your drawing turned out nicely. It That's did. Just a sketch. I drew it with a regular pencil to make it more accurate. Come on, Asya. Show them how it's done. Now we've got a birthday girl too. 
Katya looks beautiful. Okay, so I goofed. That's okay. It's really hard to color. And whose happy face is this? Warm and shiny. Okay, and then we got the houses. Okay, we're done. I wish we could all be in the village right now. Last summer was really nice. I wish things would get better soon. I hope mom will be happy when she sees my drawing. August 22nd, 1942. Everything's ready. Okay. Should we relax on the couch and wait for mum now? Sure, why not? The couch isn't going to sit on itself. Nice job, Asya. You finished everything in time. Okay. Now all we have to do is wait for mum. Nice job. That's putting it lightly. I have to hand it to you. You're done. Personally, I think it's all in vain. Oh. What are you talking about? That's the bomb siren. I had an epiphany while I slept. No good deeds will force mom to love Asya. Oh. After all, it's because of Asya that her dad went to the front. <laughs> Didn't you hear them arguing that day? Your name was mentioned for quite a few things. That's why Mom hates you. Oh, no, nah, I'm mad at Mom. I wish the ground would swallow you up, you stupid doll. <laughs> I mean, but th th all you gotta do is just tell her. All you gotta do is just tune her out or, or put her in the closet. Oh, yeah, that's a bomb strike. I was like, that's the bomb, like, sirens. Oh! Oh, my Atlantis? <laughs> Wow, that was crazy. I don't know how she didn't blow up, but. On August 23rd, 1942, the German army destroyed Stalingrad and killed over 90,000 people. Wow. The city was left in smoldering ruins. Over the course of the invasion, Wehrmacht soldiers removed about 60,000 civilians from Stalingrad for forced labor in Germany. Asya and her mother were among them.
Wow, that, wow, that's crazy. Okay, let's see what happens. Day, wow. So two years done passed. Day 853 in Germany. I know you're tired. I know it's hard. Okay, hold on. Can I? Okay, so we're going to stop it here. Yeah. We'll stop it here. Because we would be on chapter two. So how many chapters is in this? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, it tells you. Okay. So I don't have to count. So there's 26 chapters in this. Um, but we are going to stop it here. Because that was a pretty, like, wow. Um, so we'll stop it here um, for now. Um, I may actually end up bringing this one back and trying to finish this one on stream. But we'll do like a chapter per stream um, to make it easier. But yeah, that is torn away. Again, this one is available on PC. It goes for $14.99 USD on Steam. Of course, if you like what you saw of the game and you are here with us in chat this evening, you can use exclamation point GOTC. And that's going to bring up a list of the games that are being played for the evening. Um, and if you are watching this VOD on YouTube, then the information for the game will be in the description box below the video. But that was like, holy cow, that is torn away. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to add that one to the cart. Um, because, yeah, that one's, this one's really good. Um, so. Let's exit that. Like, if I didn't have these other games lined up, I probably would have played, kept, play, kept playing this one. But I do have other games lined up. So what I think I'm going to do is put Torn Away on for every Friday as well. And um, play one chapter per week is what we'll do. But let us switch over to our next game, which is Berserk Boy. So I'm kind of excited to play this one because it reminded me a lot of Mega Man. So really excited to play Berserk Boy. Okay. This one probably, I know for sure, uses a controller. I haven't played a controller game in so long. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm hoping that it will actually be able to be played with a dual shot controller. Ideally. And it looks like it will be. So let's do that. All right. And so our next game before we actually start this up is Berserk Boy. And this just recently released, I believe it was like a week or two ago. Um, this one goes for $20 on Steam. It is also available on the Nintendo Switch store. Um, there was some issues where it had been removed from the European Switch store, but um, checking through the tweets that the developer posted out, it looks like everything was worked out. So it is now also available in the um, European store as well. Um, but this one, is, we're playing the Steam version of Berserk Boy here, and it goes for $20 on Steam. There is a free-to-play demo as well, so if you like what you see and you want to give it a try for yourself before you buy, um, you can play the free-to-play demo. And again, I'd like to take the time to thank the developer 
for providing me with a free copy of Berserk Boy to play on tonight's stream. Of course, again, if you are here in chat, feel free to use exclamation point GOTC. And if you are watching this video on YouTube, the information will be in the description box below. So let's go ahead and jump into Berserk Boy. We're going to do English. And I am using a DualShock 4 controller for this. Sweet. <laughs> that was awesome timing. Tutorials do not. Okay. Okay, filling is opening. Hold on. We gotta watch the opening. Okay. Okay, so let's just look at the options real quick. I don't want to take off death. I kind of want to leave death on for now. So let's do new game. Yes. So I like that. So it has modern, which plays with infinite retries and then retro for those that are um, more into the retro style of games, which was back in the day, you had a certain amount of lives. And once those lives were gone, that was it. <laughs> they were just gone. <laughs> like, you know, back in our day <laughs> when you played games, you, you had to go back to the levels that gave you free lives and stock up on them. Yes, I am talking about Donkey Kong Country and Donkey Kong Country 2 and Donkey Kong Country 3, where I would go back to the first level and stock up on as many lives as possible. Usually 99. Um, okay, but we're, I'm going to play it with the modern rules because I want um, the infinite retries. I am not brave enough to do retro. So we're going to do modern. Wow, an achievement just for that. Oh! I'm up. I'm up. What's going on? I managed to pick up a huge energy rating. Like, Berserk Orb huge. Kai, we gotta follow this signal. Dizzy, do you ever, you know, chill out? Chill out? We haven't gotten time to chill. There could be a Berserk Orb practically next door. If I could just get a glimpse, read the energy signature. Think about it, Dizzy. It can't be a Berserk Orb. They haven't been seen for decades. Can we please just check during the mission and follow the signal? It'll only take a minute. There's no way it's a Berserk Orb, but Dizzy isn't usually wrong. <laughs> okay, fine. Call me in. We could be onto something big here, Kai. You wouldn't you won't regret it. I'm just waiting for him to go Super Saiyan. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say it, but I was like, all I kept thinking was, come, yeah, or, you know, do the Kamehameha way. Uh, resistance. Move out. I played, I want to say I played the demo of Berserk Boy back during, like, one of the Steam Next Fest. Roger, Roger. Cause this looks like really familiar. Uh -huh. Excellent. Area secured. Good work. Let's make our way through the rest of New Hope City. I don't like this. The city's crawling with dark energy. How did all these shades get through our defenses? Listen up. All civilians are to be teleported to the nearest safe zone. We have a schedule to keep. Okay. I didn't have to read that because that was voiceovered. I thought that would never end. They don't advertise all this waiting around on the recruitment posters. <laughs> Dizzy. Looks like the coast is clear. We got no time to lose. The reading's coming from over there. We don't have long, Dizzy. We can't get caught running off. You just have to keep up then. Come on. Okay. 
not gonna lie, love the sound effects. Man, she's fast. Oh, this is really gorgeous, though. Okay. I'm really liking this. And then the controls move so well. Because I think when I first played it, obviously there were some issues with the controls, if I'm not mistaken. But man, are the controls crisp in this. So, uh, the orb. That's strange. The energy levels are spiking, but I can't see anything unusual. Maybe my calculations were a little off. Nope! Whoa, what was that? She Willikers, Batman! <laughs> An earthquake? What? In this sector? What are the chances? Kai, these energy readings, they're even higher than before. And they're rising. They're what? This doesn't feel right, Dizzy. We should get back to the warp point. To the Batmobile. Like right now. Oh! M missiles? I mean, y'all could have ran, though. I'm just saying. I mean, I wouldn't have been standing there. Like, hurry up. Whoa. Okay. Oh, my head. And of course, I landed in the middle of nowhere. Did we trigger some old defense system? Knowing Dizzy's luck, she probably landed away closer to. Landed way closer to the center. Still, I should be able to catch up with her if I hurry. That's a pretty funky looking bird. Wait, is it on fire? Does this have something to do with the energy spikes? Listen, kid, you gotta get out of here. <laughs> it talks. That fall must have been worse than I thought. You gotta get the teleporter back to safety. I'm not leaving until I find my friend. If I help you find your friend, do you promise you'll start moving? Deal. Oh, his name is K, not Kai. My bad. I'm K, by the way. And if you could talk, I'm guessing you have a name too, right? Or am I still hallucinating? Fiore. Now, can we please get a move on? Let's go, Fiori. So the one thing I will say is like the voiceover part of it is a little low. <laughs> it's a good thing you're so scrawny. I might be able to carry you. Nice. Okay, so... Okay, this music is on point, though. Oh, man, a roadblock. I don't suppose you got a blunt heavy object hidden in those feathers. I mean, I could probably knock this thing down. But how? No offense, Fiori. But you're not exactly an albatross. Nice. Don't have to tell me twice. I think I goofed. Hey, little dude, are you okay? I I'm okay, but I lost my brothers. This kid shouldn't be out here. It isn't safe. Good thing I'm a teleporter then, isn't it? I can warp anything we find back to home base. Get ready, little man. Does it feel like you're on a roller coaster? Wait, are there people down there? Sit tight, you guys. Help is on the way. Nice. 
A teleporter? That's me. Don't worry, I just got your brother to safety. You came to rescue us? There was a big explosion and we were split up. Thanks, mister. There could be others stranded out here. Luckily, there's warp points all over this area. I could use them to get around easily. Okay, so this is a... This is more like a Metroidvania, it seems like. Is this where I want to go? Yeah. Let's get you to safety. Just what the heck is going on around here? Th thank you. Is that it? Okay, try dressing into the shade over there. You gotta tell me twice. I was gonna say, something tells me I probably need to go up here. Nope, okay, it's just background. Up a second. What? Why? Something's off about this place. It's a boss fight. Whoever blew up that ship could be nearby. You're no use to anyone if you're in a million tiny pieces. Who are you? Tell me where the orb is and I may just spare your life. Where is it? <laughs> Sorry. That guy's in a scientist uniform. Is he resistant? His name is Dr. Genos. His research into the Berserk Orbs turned into an obsession. When I saw the road he was going down, I took off with one of the orbs. You can see what happened next. People are getting hurt. I never meant for this. Go Berserk. Go berserk. Wait, Berserk or? Oh, too late. Looks like my time is worth more than your life after all. I shall kill you now. You, you'll never get away with this. Genos. Stop this right now. Yeah, this has gone too far. Ah, look who's decided to come flapping back. Double-crossing me will earn you no favors. You, get out of here. I see you've merged with my orb, too. That's your orb. How amusing. I shall give you one chance to return it. Before I pluck every feather from your puny body. Genos, you're losing control. This isn't what you want. You insolent ball of feathers! You know nothing of my goal. I keep thinking of Frieza, I'm sorry. 
I am on the verge of greatness, and neither you nor the resistance can stop me. Save the monologue, Genos. You know this was never the plan. We wanted to help humanity. Use the orbs for good, make the world better. And that is exactly what I shall achieve. I alone shall reshape and restore this planet. And I will not have you stand in my way. No! Arrgh. He just hit on with a Kamehameha. Is he Vegeta? <laughs> I mean, that, that's a berserk orb. Dizzy was right. This guy sounds like serious bad news. <laughs> Any last words? Yoink! Arrgh. Yep. Okay. Who's this little brat? Fjord, get out of here. If he's really after the orb, you've got to go. Super Saiyan. This, this hurts. Uh, yeah, I can imagine. Oh, man, this is bad. Okay, listen to me. Living creatures can't control berserk orbs. You just got to shout the trigger words. Go berserk! <laughs> Thank God, because I did not want to have to do that one. My body! Did I just merge with the orb? Hey, get us out of here. Let's go. He merged with it? What a fascinating specimen! Flame drill! I have your first assignment, that's a wife. Follow that bird and the boy with it. It should be a wonderful opportunity to test out those new powers of yours. Yeah, boss. I've been burning to get to action. No, not the pun. Not the, not the pun. I couldn't sleep all ignite. <laughs> It's gonna be a real enough. We are all well aware that you can control fire. Burn, burn, burn. <laughs> Silence. Be gone with you. Okay. Oh. Ah, oh, Fior, what's happening to me? Concentrate, key. Oh man, I can feel my nerves buzzing. Do it now. Oh, well. Just as I feared, the security's been taken out. Now there's nothing stopping Dark Energy from overrunning the city. I can't stop sh shaking. Okay, I know you can do this. The ores react to your emotions. Center yourself. Take a deep breath. I need you to merge with the orb again. Ah, oh, that's easy for you to say. You're not the one doing this. <laughs> you know what to say, right? Come on, Kay. You can do this. Deep breaths. Amazing stuff, you know? I need a, I need an anime for this. It really worked, or a comic. I don't even be. I don't even set up with a webtoon. This feels good. Take this. Oh. Now, let's go find Dizzy. Collect red health ores to increase your health when you have taken damage. Standing on chat points restores your health to max. Your energy refills over time. Collect blue orbs to fill up your energy meter faster. Some abilities depend on your energy meter, so be carry sure to keep an eye on it. Yellow berserk orbs and defeating enemies will fill up your berserk meter. Okay, Berserk Energy does not fill up automatically. Your Berserk Move icon should appear when you have enough Berserk Energy to do a special attack. Okay, make sure to use your Berserk ability to dish out major damage. Are you okay there? Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Still trying to... Hey, you okay there? Okay. I don't even think we hit a save point yet. Okay, we did. Love the music in this too. Music is on point. take this to a teleporter. We don't have the ability for this yet.
on there. We probably could have grabbed those, but... Dang it! How far back do we have to go? Oh, not that far. Warning. It smells like a boss fight. Help, somebody help us. More shades. We got this, Kay. Let's take them out. Let's find out what you got. Oh. Alright, we got this. Okay, let's see how it works out though. Okay, we should be good this time around. Try to get through this boss battle, then we'll switch to our next game. Let's find out what you got. Okay. Dang it. We got him down further that time. I want to try to, like I said, at least get um, this boss beat. I mean, I didn't beat Chill Penguin in an ape, so. 
Let's find out what you got. Oh man, biscuit. Got him. I, I, I did better than what I thought I was going to do. Three times the charm, right? Save the day for the first time. Are you guys okay? Thank you. Don't mention it, but it's not safe around here. I'm going to send you back to home base. We won't forget this. Still, no sign of Dizzy. This isn't good. Plus, security seems to be down all over the city. If the generators are bust, there's no... Stopping those things coming in. So what now? Let's head back to base. Maybe Dizzy and the Resistance are waiting for us. We'll tell the commander what's going on. He'll know what to do. You're coming too, right? I'm stuck with you for the time being, kid. Let's head to base. Do it. Okay. Oh, wow. I got the high score for s apparently getting a high score. And then it, because I died six times, it took half of my score away. But you know what? I got a rank B. That's not bad. Phew, we made it. Oh, don't mind the mess. I uh, wasn't expecting visitors. Oh, is this just your room? What do you... What? Did you think this was the whole place? I'll show you around later. First though, we should tell the commander what just happened. He'll probably be in the command center. Lead the way, Kay. Okay, so I am going to save and quit to menu. And so that was a little bit of Berserk Boy. Um, again, if you like what you saw of the game, you can use exclamation point G-O-T-C. And that will break up a list of all the games that I am playing tonight. Um, also, um, this one is available on Steam as well as Nintendo Switch. It does go for $20 USD. Um, and I do want to take the time to thank the developer of Berserk Boy for providing me with a free copy of the game to play on tonight's stream. I really like this one a lot. Um, being that I am a big fan of like Mega Man, this kind of gives me a little bit of Mega Man vibes. Um, because I can't say like, well, we haven't had a new Mega Man game in a while because that's not true, you know, we had like 30XX, but um, I really enjoyed this one a lot. This one was really good, so um, I would say pick it up. If you're into platformers and things like that as well. Although I don't think I saved all of the resistant. I didn't see if the resistance bar on the last part had went up completely. But yeah, that's Berserk Boy. Alrighty. Alrighty. So let's switch over to our next game, which is a free-to-play game. And that is Rabbit Hole. And then um, the last game of the evening is going to be Chill Town. So, um, let us go ahead and switch over to Rabbit Hole. And again, as I have stated before, if there are any games that you do wish to see that are on the card for tonight and you're unable to stick around because I do stream kind of late, 
Um, you do have the option of watching the VODs on YouTube. Again, I usually upload them immediately after stream to YouTube. Um, so they will be up either sometime tonight or sometime tomorrow. Um, and then tomorrow we are going to be playing The Sims 4. So, um, just to kind of let you all know what's going to be going on. Alrighty. Did I not install rabbit hole? Yeah, I was gonna say, I know I did. All right. So let's jump into rabbit hole. Okay, so apparently this one does not use controller. But we will see. Um, so we're gonna hit play. Hopefully this will capture. If not, then we will switch over to um, Jail Town if it doesn't. Okay, let me see if I can get window capture. Oh, this is a new grounds game. That makes sense why I wouldn't use controller. Do you? Memento Vibus, remember you will live. A burden you have to carry forever. Yet, there's this is a place between the dream and the real. A safe space for those who have lost heart. Welcome to the rabbit hole. Okay, so it said it didn't use controller, but I just used controller. But because it says it's not supported for controller, we'll use the keyboard and mouse. So let's do new game. Okay. So obviously we have to play with the main character because uh, it does look cute. I think this is actually an action roguelite. Yo. Stupid. Dumb. Dealer. Sorry about that. Uh. Di di disc? Yeah, disc. So, your heart. How'd you lose it? Wait, let me guess. I uh, broke up with you. Boyfriend broke up with you. Unfulfilling job. Or I stole it with my looks. <laughs> this character is very vain. Tough crowd. Anyways, I'll lend you my jacket. This one's on the house. Ciao. In the pockets of the puffy jacket, you find bunny ears and a mask. You decide to wear them as well as the jacket. Okay. I don't think I like... The keyboard and mouse controls on this. Let's see. So it doesn't have full support. 
of the keyboard in them. But... Or full support of a controller. But, um... You died. It has semi-support. So, it would be nice if they could go back. Um, this is a free-to-play game, though. Okay, so let me see, because it's really kind of difficult to play with keyboard and mouse with this. But... Okay. Just risk it all. I don't have any money. So we made it to level four. We didn't even make it to level four. We only made it to level one. Let's try it one more time. Like I said, the one thing I don't like is um ha huh. okay Gotta leave it the way it is. Okay. Alright, so we will play. We'll give it another go. We can't afford anything. Why would y'all put that up there first? Try the X. We don't. Uh, well, we have enough of this. Play me. What in the blue devil? 
Oh, pretty. Huh. <laughs> well, you know, they can't win them all. <laughs> So that is Rabbit Hole, also known as Dark Souls. <laughs> Cutesy Dark Souls. <laughs> but if you like what you saw of Rabbit Hole, again, you can pick this one up on Steam. This one is a free-to-play. Um, I will probably play a little bit of more of this off-stream. I'm going to see if I can actually kind of set up the controller. Um... <laughs> right, prepared to all edition of Dark Souls. Um, I'm gonna see if, cause I know like Steam allows for you to kind of set up the controllers, um, for yourself. Um, so I'm gonna see if I can kind of do that. Um, cause this would be a great game if I could play with controller. Like I'm not a fan of keyboard and mouse, um, controls for this. Um, it has semi control support, but not full control support. Um, but if you like what you saw of Rabbit Hole, I would say go ahead and uh, pick this one up. It's free on Steam. Um, you can add it to your library. You don't necessarily have to install it uh, because, again, it is free to play. But if you do download it, you might want to give it a go. Um, of course, if you are here in chat this evening, um, the you can use exclamation point GOTC. And if you are watching this video on youtube then the information for the game will be in the description box below all righty so now we are going to uh get into our last game which is chill town and this just released like last week um i was supposed to play it last week when it released but um i didn't get a chance to play it due to the fact of me not having the hot spot um so we are gonna go ahead and play this for the remainder of stream and then we will wrap up stream probably by 11 30 at the latest so um but yeah let's go ahead jump into chill town trying to find it because it always has an update but let's see Hopefully, it will just capture. At least that's what I'm hoping for, that it's just going to capture. Okay. Early access notice. Dear players, thank you for joining us on this exciting journey into Tail Town. We are thrilled to have you on board as we continue to develop and refine our game. It's important for us to inform you that Chill Town is still in development in the development phase, which means there may be some rough edges and unfinished elements throughout the gameplay. Please note that certain features such as icons, animations, models, and UI are currently placeholders and will be subject to change or improvement in the future updates. We are actively working on enhancing these aspects to create a more immersed and enjoyable gaming experience. Additionally, some functionalities are still in their early stages of development or might be temporarily locked for future adjustments. Rest assured, we are diligently working to unlock and introduce these features in subsequent releases.
Early access is also the time when the game data is still in its early stages and requires frequent updates and changes, changes, which can easily lead to compatibility issues with saved files across updates. Therefore, we kindly ask for your understanding and recommend backing up your saved files regularly or contacting us for assistance in case of any issues. Your support and feedback are crucial to the success of Chilltown, and we greatly appreciate your understanding during this phase of development. Please don't hesitate to share your thoughts, suggestions, and bug reports with us as we value your input in making Chilltown the best it can be. Thank you for being a part of our community and for helping us shape Chilltown into a fantastic and unforgettable gaming experience. Best regards, low high tech. Okay. And so this is Chilltown. And as it was stated before, um, Chilltown is in early access. It is currently on sale. It goes for $14.99 USD normally, but it's currently on sale for $13.49 USD up until April the 5th. So that's up until next Friday. Um, again, this is an early access of the game. So the things that you see now may or may not be in the final version of the game when it does release into its full release. Um, do keep in mind... Um, that when you do purchase a game that is in early access, you are paying for the game in its current state with the hopes that it will move from early access to a full release. So do keep that in mind. Um, now, if I'm not mistaken, typewriter, fake language voice. We'll do fake language voice for the sound. Keyboard. So it looks like they're going to be supporting um, controllers in the future, which is cool. Um, I think when I played the demo for this, I think I played keyboard and mouse, so that's fine. Accessibility, looks like they're going to have an accessibility menu. Um, and then Kickstarter. If you backed it on Kickstarter which I actually got a copy of the game from the developers. So let's go ahead and I want to take the time to thank the developers for providing me with a free copy of Chill Town for tonight's stream. Okay, so let's jump into this. We're gonna do new save data. Dig up all artifacts. Okay, it kind of just gave me a achievement. I didn't do anything, but okay. Hey, glad you found the place all right. Did our directions help? The GPS always sends people to the wrong building. Yeah, I went there once. All the employees have this weird smile on their face. I know, right? Who likes being perky all the time? I like keeping life as relaxed as possible. Me too. Ah... Anyways, I'm Mimi, and I'm Tutu, <laughs> Jacob Tutu, <laughs> sorry, and we're your flight concierge here at Alvent Guardian Airlines. We'll be walking through, walking you through the onboarding process to get you to your destination in no time. And once we get you set up for your flight, it'll be time for our afternoon coffee break. So, what's your name? Now, I'm not sure if this game has, like, um, DMCA music in it. My birthday is in winter. Awesome! Looks like we got you booked for a one-way trip to Chill Town. Whoa! Do you like to chill as much as we do? Sucking up the afternoon rays? Listening to lo-fi beats? I do. Positive vibes. Letting the world drift away. Ah. 
It's always nice meeting another wanderer living on our frequency. Anyways, come stand in front of our camera to gather your physical characteristics. Ah. Okay, um... I like this one. I want to vibe. I think these are more of my eye color. That is cute. That is also cute. That is also cute. That is also cute. <gasps> what? It's close to my avatar. Okay, let's do hair color. No, not pink. No. Uh, that kind of fits. I don't even know how to process that because why is she red? Okay, I need to know, like, seriously, why the dark browns are red? It's like a red hue to them. I mean, that's my hue there, but... But I do need to know why the darker, like, the browns are, like, red. Like, that needs to be tweaked. But we'll go with this. Now we need clothes. Oh! It's like my little character. This one's a little more close to it. <laughs> this one's a little close to it. Yeah, she's kind of close to it. Just, I don't like that the color, but... Or is this one? No, definitely this one. And then let's do glasses. Yeah, oh, she's so cute. I love your look, by the way, Ready Set. So stylish. Dude, don't be a creep. Sorry, was that awkward to say? No, do do. Yeah, I think. Oh, dang. I just heard the pilot starting up the engine. Yeah, you're right. Come on, let's get your luggage on board, ready, set. And once we're settled in our seats, it's time for that sweet, sweet coffee break. <sighs> then we'll be in chill town in no time. Okay, so some performance for you. Tutu. Oh, wow, we are moving really slow. Tutu, next time we fly, can you please remind me to bring earplugs? You were snoring the entire time. We're gonna skip this because it's like really moving slow. Oh, okay, looks like it's picking up. Excuse you, Mimi. I will not be shamed for my healthy sleeping patterns. <laughs> The gentle lulling of the plane engine. My body's inexplicable tendency to get sleepy after drinking caffeine. It may have been the best sleep of my life. Right. Oh, ready said, I nearly forgot. Welcome to Chill Town. Oh, yeah. Didn't Lemire want to speak with Ready said as soon as we arrived? 
Indeed. You're part of the first wave of residents to move onto the island, Reddy said. Yeah, I think Mayor had some important city planning he wanted to discuss. I'm impressed you remembered, Tutu. Looks like all that sleep helped your memory. You should try it sometime, Mimi. Shh, enough of you. All right, Reddy said. Let's get you to the town square to speak with the mayor. Okay, so hopefully it doesn't keep lagging like that. Because that's pretty rough. Okay. Meet the mirror in the town square. Meet the mirror. Okay. Press M to... Okay, let's see if we can fix this. Because... Use the map to navigate. Okay. Okay, so it's really kind of bogging down a bit. Yes, seeds, open your journal. I would like to go to settings, please. Okay. Okay, I would like to go to settings, please. Alright, let's turn down the quality for now. I'm gonna turn on... I'm gonna turn it to medium and see if that helps it. Still a little bit laggy. Yeah, it's still a little laggy. Okay, hold on. Let's try it with V-Sync on. We'll go back to high. Apply the changes. Nope, it's still laggy. Oh, okay, it's kind of... if. You move too fast, it kind of... Okay. So let's play around with this for a little bit. Okay, let's try maybe turning depth of field off. I hate to have to take the FPS down, but I will if I have to. Um, let's go see if it'll... Let me go back to full screen. We'll do that. Okay, let's see. It's still a little laggy. Not gonna lie, and I'm not liking it being on 30 frames. Maybe turn off anti-alias. I know I turned it up to 90, but let, let's just for funsies. Yeah, it's still overloading the encoder. Okay, let me try. Okay, let's, we're just trying different things at this point. Oh, that looks nice. 
So this one, it's not, it's lagging, but it's not as bad, I guess. All right, let's go back to 30. Definitely not doing 120. So this entire time I thought I was recording, but I was not. <laughs> so this one I'm probably going to have to uh, grab off of Twitch. Uh, let's see. Okay, let me see. Yeah, it's like really like... Okay. Because I've tried some of everything at this point. Okay, I turned off anti-aliasing. It's moving a little better. It's not as choppy. Let me see. Yeah, it's a little bit better. Yeah, it's, and I'm like, I think my uh, VTuber is moving kind of slow. Let me, um, so give me a second. Let me see something. Let's see if maybe, so I'm going to turn off my VTuber for a moment and see if that might help with a little bit. Yeah, okay, so apparently with this one, I cannot have my VTuber up while I'm playing because it seems to be moving a lot better now that I've turned the VTuber off. Yeah, it's moving a heck of a lot better now. So... With this one, I just can't, when I'm recording or when I'm doing gameplay for Chill Town, I'll have to turn off the VTuber, it looks like. Okay. Press uh, space to interact. Good. Yeah, because see, look how fast it's moving after I've turned off the VTuber, the VTube model. So, that's fine. Um, in fact, let me see. Okay, hold on. Let me see. I want to say I actually have... Let me see. Oh, this one doesn't have it. Okay, hold on. Uh 
Okay. Okay, let's see. Just so it doesn't look awkward without anything there. So we know for um for Jill Town we have to do it this way. Okay. Uh good. That wasn't as long of a walk as I was expecting. Oh sir, here's what I said. The most recent resident to make landfall. You wanted to see them? Ah, yes. Greetings, ready, set. Your name is music to my ears. Come, come. I have so much to tell you. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Otto. Though my esteemed colleagues here refer to me as the mayor of this picturesque vista. I'm pretty sure we call you that because you are the mayor, sir. In truth, Freddy said, I tend to think of myself as little more than an overgrown child with an ambition. A lofty dream to build a paradise where visitors from all corners of the globe can retreat and relax. At least, that is my vision for Chilltown. It may take many moons before it comes into fruition. However, progress occurs at what some might describe as tortoise-like speed here. Not to mention, I like to take my fair share of nap breaks, same as the next person. Here, here to that, sir. Late last year, I sent out a call to the universe for residents who value a chiller pace, and here you are. Chill Island may look rather humble right now, but I am certain with your assistance. Along with help from more residents on their way this very second, this remarkable locale will develop into an idyllic home. Its foundations built not on productivity, but tranquility. Gosh, I always get teary-eyed listening to the old mayor talk about this place. Hey, I'm not that old. I know how to chill just as much as the youth, right? Oh, of course, sir. Your chill skills are remarkable, sir. Oh, please. Anywho, Reddy said, I do have some the bad news. I am afraid our accommodations are not yet that luxurious. But we'll build to that. We'll must, we must always keep the dream alive, right? Darn straight. For now, I'll have our building crew construct you a tiny house where you can stay until we gather more resources for grander abodes. With you being part of our first wave of residents, you have the privilege of selecting where you want to lay your first foundation. How about you explore the island a little bit, get your toes in the dirt, fill out where you'd like to settle down, and take this to mark where you want to cons the construction crew to construct your tiny house. You will see the building permit after that. After that, meet me back at the town square entrance, and we can go over your your next steps. Excellent speech, sir. The best I've heard yet. Oh, give it a rest, Tutu. Have fun exploring. Ready, set. Okay. Find a place to build your house. Find a place to build your house. And then we get a desk, a wardrobe, a chair, and a bed. Okay. Oh, I get to choose the house I want. No, I don't want that house. That house is ugly. 
<laughs> I'm like, no, I don't want that house. Um, I like this house. This house is cute. Let's see. Yeah. Are you sure you want to build a house at this location? You won't be able to change the house location until a certain process is complete. Yes. Okay. So again, there is a little bit of performance issue with this. Um, but definitely having my VTuber um, software running was not good for this. Ah, there you are already set. Isn't the sea air so refreshing here? It gives new life to my city-grown bones. Now then, did you have a chance to decide what you wanted to say? Yes. Good. Chill Island is such a beauty, wouldn't you agree? We're so lucky to have found it uninhabited and perfect for our laid-back community. Though there are some pesky details around logistics we must discuss. <laughs> Why does everything always have to have pesky details? Ah, come now, Tutu. It's not that bad. Your tiny house is included in your travel package, though. Through Aviant Guardian Travels. And now, there's a perk to write home about. But going forward, you'll be on your own to earn resources to save for more upgrades and additions to your estate. Don't you worry, though, Ready Set. The island supports us in many ways. And as you wait for the construction crew for, to finish building your tiny house, you can stay at Hotel Misty in town. I chatted with the good staff there, and they've agreed to let you stay for a few days. Aww, that's so nice of them. Ready Set. You definitely have to try the food at Chez Calamo. It's delicious. Oh, Tutu, you think grass was delicious if you could stuff your face with it? He already said, take this letter of recommendation to the hotel staff and you'll be all set. With my signature, something else happened because I skipped it by mistake. In the meantime, I'm going to head back to Town Hall. Usually around this hour, the city planner set out donuts. Feel free to ask me any questions you have about the residents on the island so far. My door is always open, letting in the ocean air. And most importantly, welcome to Chill Town. Ready, set. The island is your oyster. Okay. Check in at Miss Hotel Misty and get your room. Okay. Okay. Hello, welcome to Hotel Misty. How may we be of service? I have a letter of recommendation from Mayor Otto. Ah, yes, you must be ready, Sip. We're so happy to meet you. Mayor Otto informed us your new house is under construction for a few days, but we'll, we're more than happy to host you while you wait. We here at Hotel Misty pride ourselves on our hospitality to all tourists and residents. Please allow us to take your things and show you to your room. Weave the seaside, weave the seaside suite. Weave the, no. That, weave? That doesn't sound right. I, I mean, it doesn't sound right to me. Because, I mean, I get what they're saying. We have the seaside suite for you. And I think it should have said, we have the suite suite sweet for you instead of weave the sweet side sweet for you like it just feels weird we hope you enjoy your stay with us do you want to check into a room check into a room here's your key have a good time here You can tailor your music to match your mood by assessing the music player. Press ESE to open your mobile phone. Music.
Okay. Sleep. Okay, so I don't know why, but the beginning was really choppy, but it doesn't seem to be choppy now. Yes, I want to sleep. Oh, hello there. You must be ready, Set. I heard so much about you already from Mayor Otto. Pardon the smell. I just finished up prepping for tonight's calamari menu. But we are... Where are my manners? My name is Cora, and I am the head chef here at Chez Kelmo. I'm delighted to make your acquaintance. How about we get to know each other over a cooking session? I have a little surprise for you. Sure. Great. Now take this. Over there is the hotel kitchen. Let's make a delicious omelet out of this humble ingredient. Since you're new in town, I imagine you might not have a fully set up kitchen just yet. No worries. The hotel kitchen is at your disposal. It'll be a fun experience. Head over there. I'll guide you through the process how to cook the omelet. Okay. Yes, cook some omelette. Oh, done. I guess I can make another one. Oh, done. Okay. Oh, go to the door. I was like, how do we get out of here? Oh, hello there. I am eagerly anticipating your culinary creation. I cooked an omelet. Oh my goodness. This omelet is simply divine. You have a natural talent for cooking. I can see great potential in you becoming a fantastic chef. As a token of my appreciation, please take this stove. It'll be a valuable addition to your kitchen whenever you have it set up. Okay. Oh, and here's a little tip. When you're ready to set up your kitchen, place the stove there and use the brand new pot you just bought to cook your meals. If you haven't happened to create any new dishes, do bring them to me. I love to see what culinary wonders you've come up with. By the way, if you don't have a pot yet, you might want to visit the local grocery store in town. They usually have a great selection of kitchen supplies, including pots and plants. Just head over there, and I'm sure you'll find the perfect pot to complement your new store stove. Happy cooking. Okay. What are your thoughts on sh fishing from a chef's point of view? Fishing? It's great. What's better than relaxing on the beach and going home with a fresh protein? Luckily, the island has plenty of fish in these waters. If you can cook it fast enough without needing to freeze it, that's even better. If you don't know how to fish, you should find my husband, Do. He'll give you a lesson or two on fishing. You should be able to find him somewhere near the harbor if I had to guess. That man can be difficult to track down sometimes. Okay, let's see. Find you near the harbor. Pick this up. I don't know what that is, but we're gonna pick it up. A rock. What are you doing getting your hands all dirty? Well, I was running to the town square to see what's new in the market, but I saw something sparkling in the ground. I couldn't just keep walking once my eyes spotted something shiny, you know. What kind of an explorer would I be without some invest, invest, investigation? So, I've been trying to dig it out. 
but the dirt is too well pad for my bare hands. If only I had a shovel. Hey, you're not doing anything. Could you find a shovel for me? You'd be my best friend. Pretty please. Okay. Buy a shovel. Hi, your wife said you might have some fishing advice to share with me. Ah, I thought I heard old Otto talking about a new resident. Is that you? Well, welcome to Chilltown, I suppose. Sorry I ain't much of a fancy welcome committee. Though I'm sure my wife Cora showed you plenty hospitality when you arrive. She sure is lovely, ain't she? Daw, sir. Ah, sorry. It's easy to get distracted out here, so fishing, eh? Well, of course, I'd be willing to give you some pointers, but you don't even got a fishing rod yet. Go find five tree branches and then come back here. I'll show you how to turn it into a simple fishing rod. Oh, you can just use a simple axe to cut down a tree. Here, I just got done making this one. It's not the fancy, but a dinky hatchet made of wood and stones, but it should do the trick for what you need. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna go... Tab. Equipped. Here. Oh. I get up. Pick up. Hey, get up. Two tree branches. to see if we can save. Let me see. We can. So we can do like an auto save, which is cool. Well, look at that. You found a tree branch all on your own. Wasn't too hard, was it? Now, if you watch what I do, bend it here, twist it there, and voila! You got yourself a fishing rod. Truth be told, it is a little on the rustic side, but no bother. Here, take these two. I don't need them anymore. Now you'll be all set to ca start catching some fish. Okay. Okay, I'm actually gonna save. I think we saved. Okay, and then I'm gonna hit quick game and we're gonna go to the main menu. Uh, but yeah, that is a little bit of Chill Town. Um, now that we've kind of gotten it figured out, we will probably um, try to play more of this next week. Um, but if you like what you saw of Chill Town and you are here in chat, again, you can use the exclamation point G O T C, and that's gonna bring up a list of all the games that I've played this evening. Um, again, if you are here in chat and if you are watching this on YouTube, then the information for the game will be in the description box below. But yeah, that is a little bit of Chill Town. Again, this is an early access. Of course, we ran into some issues, um, but we kind of found some workarounds for it. Um, but again, in for chill town it does have their discord listed so you can join their discord um to talk to other like individual like-minded individuals of the game 
and follow them on Twitter to see what's going on with the game. So, all right. So I am going to go ahead. I'm just gonna switch back to the screen, even though I'm no longer on screen. <laughs> um, but I am gonna go ahead and thank everyone for tuning into tonight's stream this evening um it's kind of driving me nuts not being up on here so give me a second um but yeah so i like to thank everyone for tuning into tonight's stream you all have been amazing um, tomorrow we're gonna pretty much just chill and play some Sims 4. And that, right behind the scenes, huh? <laughs> sneak peek behind the scenes. Uh, we are gonna be playing the Sims 4 tomorrow, so we're just gonna pretty much, um, just be, you know, kicking it and chilling, um, with some of the Sims 4. Then I might play some other games here and there. Um, but for the most part, it's gonna be Sims 4 that we play. Um, and, uh, yeah, that, you know, I have to work out some things because I was going to do a play series for Chill Town, but, um, again, it is an early access, but there's still quite a few bugs, um, in the, uh, game. Um, so we'll work it out and see. Uh, to be fair, they have been updating like crazy. So I'm not mad at it. Um, you know, like I said, I just had a couple of things um, that I would like to see different with the game. Um, but I guess I am going to go ahead and wrap up stream this evening. Again, I will see you all tomorrow at 9 p.m. with some Sims 4. And as always, this is Ready Sets Gaming. I am ready, set. Please be safe and keep gaming. Yo, it's ready, set, gaming. Predominantly streaming indie games. Sprinkle with a dash of retro and sometimes triple hey. Go indie games, take me on a ride from funny side scrolling games to meaningful narrative. So sit back and relax. Indie darlings, our passions ignite. Reviews like brush strokes, painting the way. Ready, sets, game, and streams. Thursdays through Saturdays.